Hey guys, what's up? Welcome to Mark's Random Videos. Today we're going to do a quick update on a small project I've been working on. Uh, as you guys may know, I've been interested in essentially using 18650 batteries with pretty much anything. We've been using the 18650s in uh, small 4-inch long-range quads and it struck me probably a few months back that using an 18650 1S would be interesting for some of the smaller quads. Now I made an attempt and successfully flew the Beta 85. That's been quite a, a popular video where I popped the 1S 18650 onto the Beta 85 Pro 2. Uh, just to add, that did melt the other day, nothing to do with 18650s, but the flight controller expired in a big way and melted the frame and part of the top cover. Now, that's absolutely nothing to do with 18650s or this project. Essentially, since I've posted that video on the single 8650 uh, Beta 85 Pro 2, what has happened is we've seen the community actually pushing the development of this further. In particular, one FPVer that I respect massively, who is Dave C, whose designs actually led to you know the quads I fly, the iFly Camera Four, was basically a result of his previous uh, micro long range design, and this is essentially the start of a nano long range. So, the idea is that you have a small clip on connector here for the the single eighteen six fifty battery. So you take that, pop it into a connector that sits on the top, and Dave has essentially addressed uh, some of the points that I brought up in the video when I was playing around with the Beta 85 on 1S. He's moved the center of gravity by mounting everything underneath. So we've got the flight controller, we've got the Rush Tiny Tank VTX here. And we've got the Radio Master R81, which could equally be a TBS Crossfire. This just happened to be what I had laying around. And this in the middle is a Flywoo Goku F413 toothpick uh, flight controller. So all of this is now sitting mocked up on the 3D printed frame. We've got the Flywoo RB1202.5. Uh, motors on there and at the moment I've got some 65mm HQ props although I have a couple of different options to pop on here as recommended by Dave C. Uh, little Foxier camera on there although at some point I might upgrade that to the run cam which also should fit on top of this uh, 20 by 20 stack and then I do need the the bottom plate uh, the one that we 3D printed at first was not perfect. Uh, neither is the frame, of course. So I was very excited to hear that Dave C will probably be releasing this through the guys at Recon, along with potentially a freestyle version of the 4-inch, uh, which would be more suited to the, the X-frame design rather than this dead cat design. So... Really this video was just to show that I have mocked up the single 18650 uh, nano long range and to give you guys the inspiration hopefully to do something similar or to go out and, and look at Dave C's recon for, uh, sorry, recon nano long range and potentially his recon for FR. Uh, very excited about this build. You know, when you pop an 18650 into it using the, the carrier, which I'm waiting on from right chart, uh, it does look very smart, although at the moment I do have the flexibility to also potentially run this on 2S, which might give a little bit more freestyle potential to this build. Uh, really not sure. I've not seen Dave C test his on 2S, so Dave C, if you do get a minute, be lovely to, lovely to see how it runs also on a 2S450. Does that give it some more uh, freestyle capabilities? Or is this purely uh, uh, one cell nano long range as it was designed? Uh, yeah, that's about it. Really, just wanted to give you guys a quick update and show you what we've been working on here in the workshop whilst not playing with new toys like the DJI. FPV I had my first flight on yesterday
there's a, the, the X-Frame version of the Chimera 4 as well, uh, which will hopefully soon be morphing its way into a Recon 4 FR. So thanks Dave C for the Thingiverse stuff, I'll link this in the description, uh, and also for your latest update on the Nano Long Range that came out yesterday. Just to let you know, some of us in the community are moving along with you and following your progress with excitement. Cheers guys, take care, have a great day.